we have a procedure for landing the F-16, if we don't have the HUD, yes, we do. We have a procedure for pretty much everything in the airplane if you're missing or losing a sensor or some piece of equipment. So we regularly practice HUD out landings and the HUD makes it a lot easier to land. You can literally point your flight path marker at the end of the runway and if you do nothing else, your wheels will touch down at that spot. We flare, we try to land smooth, we're not the Navy. And so the HUD is very helpful, but it is not necessary. So we practice by turning down the HUD on regular occurrences to practice the sight picture. You get your peripheral vision of the ground rising up towards you. You get kind of that ground rush as you approach the ground. It's the same thing when you're learning to fly a Cessna or any other airplane that doesn't have a HUD. You learn the attitude, the landing sight picture that you get used to as you come into land. And for the F-16, we descend at about a three degree angle. Then we cut it in half just as we hit the overrun. And then we flare it off and we try to touch down about 500 feet down the runway. We do regularly practice HUD out landings and any F-16 pilot could land the jet without a HUD. I don't know if it'll be as smooth, but there's that and like and follow for more.